The Wapiti fire has more than doubled in size since it sparked in the uh, sparked in the Grand Jean area yesterday. Our Alex Livingston joins us now from the newsroom with an update from forest officials. Alex. Mark, the Wapiti fire was originally uh, reported shortly after 2 o'clock yesterday afternoon and quickly grew to 1,200 acres. Now it has grown to an estimated 4,000 acres. The fire is about 13 miles southwest of Stanley and it prompted evacuations at Sawtooth Lodge, Grand Jean Campground, and Summer Homes, and some hiking trails in the area. Officials with the Boise National Forest say four cabins and one outbuilding have been destroyed in the fire, but fortunately, no injuries have been reported. With seven engines, three helicopters, three heavy air tankers, one hand crew and one water tender. Fire crews are attacking this complicated fire from the ground and the sky, and we're told a type two incident management team has been ordered. With a fire that may be so big or so complex, it might be too much for the local unit to handle it by themselves. So these incident management teams are brought in with experienced overhead in operations and logistics. And what they do is they sort of take responsibility for the fire and take the pressure off the local units so they can continue to do the normal work that they're doing while the incident management team handles the fire. An area closure is in place around the Grand Jean area for public and firefighter safety. National Forest System Road 524, which leads from Highway 21 to Grand Jean, is closed. There are also a few hiking trails that are closed as well, like the Iron Creek Trail past the Alpine Way Junction. Cabin owners and those who have to evacuate the campgrounds are asked to call the Loman Ranger District um, to find out when it will be possible to get access to the area. Mark.